In this video, I'll show you how to recover deleted files on Windows. So I deleted some files by accident and emptied the recycle bin, then realized they are important and I want them back. What should I do? So here are five ways we can try to recover our files. First, let's talk about something important. Before you try recovering your files, stop using the drive where you lost data. The more you use it, the higher the chance your deleted files will be overwritten. Also, if you're using SSD, check if the trim command is enabled. You can do that by going into the disks property and tools and optimize and here scheduled optimization on and frequency weekly usually these are the default settings and also check when was the last optimized date on that drive because this can make data recovery difficult when the trim command runs it overwrites the deleted files and finally check if you have any backups like file history or onedrive setup now let's start simple if you have just deleted your files chances are it's still on the recycle bin so go to recycle bin and see if the file is there if you find your file here right click and click on restore now your file should appear on its original location if you can't find your files in recycle bin let's say you have emptied the recycle bin you can try file history to recover your data search for file history and open it and if the file history is turned on you can go to restore personal files and here click on restore and this will restore all your deleted files and this will only work if the file history is already turned on on. Next, you can try a tool from Microsoft called Windows File Recovery. And this is a command line utility. That means it doesn't have a GUI and you have to enter the commands manually to the command prompt and it's not user friendly. But you can try this and see if it works for you. Next, you can try previous versions feature. Select the folder where you lost the data and right click on it, properties and then click on previous versions and this also only works if the file history is turned on so here you can select the previous version of that folder and click on restore now let's say none of these methods worked for you let me show you guys this software called ease us data recovery wizard it's a simple and beginner friendly software that works even without any backup. So let me actually create a one situation here. So I have this drive where I have a couple of files. What I'm gonna do is actually delete them and I'm also gonna empty the recycle bin. Okay, so you can see here all these files came in here. So I'm gonna go and right click empty. Now there is no way to get them back. My drive is empty, recycle bin is empty. To make this even harder, what I'm going to do is actually format the drive. Let's format this. Okay, now it's formatted. All the files are completely gone. Now, let's open the EASUS Data Recovery Wizard. You'll find link in the description for this software. You can go there and download this. And here, I'm going to select that drive that I formatted. And I'm going to click on Search for Lost Data. Okay, now it's going to scan for lost data and it will take a couple of minutes depending on how large the drive is so let it complete the scan and just wait for it to say scan completed okay the scan is complete it says seven files found let's click on go to recover here we can select path or type let's go to type here let's go to pictures and jpeg and here you can see we have one image that we can preview and we can click on recover. This is very important. To save the recovered files, select the different drive. So we are recovering files from E drive. So I'm gonna select the D drive and save it there. And we can view the recovered files here. If I go to PNG, you can see there is even my picture. So I can select that and recover it just like I recovered the previous one. And if you want to, you can select multiple files and folders at once and recover them. Okay, so you can just click on recover, save it. And here, all our files are 
recovered. So if you found your important files in here, just quickly recover them and don't waste your time looking for some of the files that might be missing. Probably those missing files are overwritten already. So here is a bonus tip for you guys. To prevent data loss in the future, I recommend you guys to use the 3 to 1 backup rule. Keep three copies of your data on two different devices with one copy off-site. Maybe use external drive or cloud storage. But still, accidents can happen. Maybe you formatted the drive accidentally or deleted important data accidentally and you haven't created the backup for that. So when that happens, please make sure to not use your drive and use a software, something like Eases to recover the data. And also make sure that if it's an SSD, turn off the optimization because this will run trim command, which overwrites the data and can make recovery difficult. And yeah, that's it for this one. If you found this video useful, don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe.